Okay, so as of the last council meeting, I did say I would shame myself into having the FOGO inspection done at my house. Today, it's just about the educational side and how FOGO is going to work. Okay, so one of the first things I've noticed, Steve, that there's a lot of in this um, waste is cardboard. Yep. Perhaps we can start putting some cardboard items that are clean yep. over that way. So this container is recycled. Is re recyclable. This would be recyclable. Recyclable. So we've got food particles. We've got food, so maybe we need to start before you go. I go vol over here. There's a food container here with food in it. It's quite right, food. Yep. So there's food can go in the in the fogo. Fogo. Yep. It says tray recycle. Yes. So that's this part that we spoke about. Film leave attached. Leave it attached, yes. So these are great examples of how the packaging industry is modernising. Make up what? Absolutely. Red bin? Red bin. Done. I've been uh, saying that we might need an extra red bin. Mm. We might need an extra yellow bin. It's possible. <laughs> eggs, of course, can go in your garden, but they green bin? Green bin. So from 1 July, eggshells can go into photo. Again, rinsed out. Yep. So an item like that could be certainly wiped out with paper towel and then the container itself can be recycled. Your kids particularly educate them to know that this takes up a lot of room. Yep. Yeah, so if they pull it apart and they squash it down, it takes up a lot less room. So when we come to this situation that we've got now, we've got more space to do our red bin than we anticipated. The green bin's done. Um, these containers. Mm -hmm. If you loosen the lid off, don't take it off all the way. Just let it so you can yeah, squash all the air out, squash it all the way down. But yeah, whatever you need to do to make it as small as possible. Then and do then do it up and now it takes up about a third of the space. Well, what an exercise it's been, Joe. Steve, I think your family has done brilliantly. There's clearly a lot of things you're doing uh, very, very well already. And with the introduction of FOGO, you're you're pretty much all set. And so the food waste that we've identified, you'll be able to divert that very easily using the kitchen caddy. And now that you know a bit more about what can and can't be recycled, you'll have a lot more room in the red lid bin. Yeah, look, that's um, part of the learning process, I guess, to see that much coming out of the bin is just um, gobsmack. It can be, and it can be a real reality check and, and good on you for going through this. To those at home, uh, it provides some context into what council's trying to achieve with the FOGO.